there. It's still too hot to punch.
So same thing. I try to put on a on a hind shoe. I try to put as much pitch on the quarter as I do in the toe. Because a, a hind feet will usually have more angle at the outside quarter than it does at the dorsal aspect. You guys think about feet. I did on my toe, right? Just like tons of time on it. No. I beat it into a V, built the heel, make that arc look like that arc. Just nails down the middle. Okay. All right. So it's just a system, and it works the same in every shoe, regardless if you're making a roadster, draft shoe. They all have to have this shoe inside of it to be usable. So practicing plain stamps. Out of sections is one of the best things you can ever do. Because every shoe has to have the ascendant, has to have the basics. Alright, push. The center. It's my inside. So I'm not gonna put a check in it, I'm just gonna push everything to the middle. Safe it up a little bit. Same thing again, tongs out of the way. Start at the heel in the same spot, push. When I can't push anymore, just drop your hand. Right to center. Overlap the blow, eight at a time. I see to punch now. So everything's already done. I might have to go back and fix stuff, redo it, use a turning hand. Or whatever else, it helps the time or on and off on this. It takes forever to turn these things. 
imagine an hour ago turning this thing on and off 10 times, that's two minutes of your go that's wasted at the fire. Okay, so it just gives you some little valves to put back there. All right, so the hind shoe again, it's a little more work on the medial. You gotta add safety and stuff. So again, just push to center. Everything's in with the hammer. Alright, cool. Put these up. 